Today we're going to learn a little bit more about architectural proportion. Now this is when you're using the same sized objects throughout the house or on one side of the doorway like this picture. The side lights on the doors are the same size. That's in proportion with the windows. Next on the list are the doors. The two doors are equal sizes. And this is common. You usually aren't going to have a three-foot door and a two-foot door, um, especially on a French door, because the window panes aren't going to line up. Like this picture here, you can see that the window panes, each individual pane, is in proportion to the other sizes and will actually line up with the other window panes. Everything's in proportion. Even the bottom of the porch, the concrete porch here, the stair step is centered and the two sides are in proportion. So they are equally sized objects that are used throughout the house and it's not uncommon. Architects do this for a reason because it looks nice, it's appealing. If you use odd-sized objects throughout the house, you're going to get some wacky reactions from people. It's just not going to look right. They're not really going to know what they're looking at. So um, take a look at your home or other homes and see where the proportion works and where it doesn't work throughout the home. See what you come up with. So that's about it for architectural proportion, but it is something you need to know about.